Welcome to Blues Rock Weekly, your source for what's happening in the world of blues rock. Ben Harper is celebrating the release of his new album, Bloodline Maintenance, with a music video for Need to Know Basis. About the track, Harper says, quote, Need to Know Basis is about how hard it is for some people to say I love you and how people can be waiting to hear that from them. Harper is in the midst of a world tour over in Europe before heading to North America at the end of August. Blues Rockers Bourbon House have a new music video for Resonate. It's the first of five singles the band plans to release before the end of the year. Lead singer Lacey Crow says, quote, We're inspired by so many of the rock music pioneers from the 60s and 70s, and we wanted to pay our respects by creating a track that isn't just influenced by them, but is an obvious nod to them. What those decades of rock bands have accomplished with their music is timeless and still resonates today. Chris Antonick has released a lyric video for Back to the Good. It's from Antonick's upcoming album, Morning Star, available on August 5th. You can hear the track now at bluesrackreview.com. Crystal Shawanda has announced her new album, Midnight Blues, will be released on September 30th. The album was produced and engineered by her husband, Dwayne Strobel, in Nashville. The Juno Award-winning singer has a music video for the first single, How Bad Do You Want It? About the album, Crystal says, quote, this is absolutely my favorite album I've ever recorded because I feel like my husband put me in a picture frame. Emmanuel Casablanca has a new music video for Bloodshot Eyes. That song features Albert Castilia. It's from the Brooklyn-based guitarist's upcoming debut album, Blood on My Hands. The album also features appearances from Eric Gales, Paul Gilbert, and more. Well, that's the Week in Blues Rock. As always, subscribe and hit that notification bell so you never miss a video. And please give the video a like. It helps get the video out to more people. And we really appreciate the support. We'll see you next time on Blues Rock Weekly.